I'm just going to show you how I would use Desmos for any question that you could possibly use Desmos for. So let's start with number 13 says it's 6 over 7p plus 18 equals 54. What is the value of 7p? So I'll show you how to use Desmos for this. Again, I'm just going to change the p to an x. That way it can use Desmos. So 6 over 7x plus 18 equals 54. And then here I'll type the second part, which is what is the value of 7p, but again I'm changing p to x, so I'm going to write 7x. And so what happens is I should see two lines that were plotted. Now the first line is going to be pretty far over, so make sure you zoom out. If you, if you typed in two situations and you only see one line, zoom out a little bit because maybe, you know, your window is just too small. So then I'm just going to go ahead and click on the intersection right there. And remember that P is X, right? So I got 42 comma 294. This is X, 42 is X, and this is Y. So remember that P is X, so this is actually just P right here. They're asking you for the value of 7p. So please do not accidentally answer 42. The answer is 294. Okay, 42 is the value of p, not the value of 7p. So be clear, the value of 7p is 294. If you need help with math, book a session with me online or in person at feelingalgebraic.com.